So I am going into Bath and Body Works. I'm not shopping, you guys, because I'm starting to save money because um, I have decided to move. I'm going to tell you guys all the details and stuff like that. Um, I'm going to sit down and like talk and stuff like that in another video. Um, I already told you guys I wanted to move, but I made like an official decision. Um, people in my personal life know. Um, but yeah, I'm here to get like a free little trial size because they send you the things in the mail and stuff. I'm here to get my little gift or whatever. So I'm here to, hi, how you doing? Good. So I'm here to see what they got. Oh, this smells gonna get the guaf. Pineapple, have y'all smell this? Oh, oh. Touch the shit out of my lips. Yep. I feel like I gotta disinfect them now. I feel some type of way. I don't know how that just happened. No, I'm sorry. It's not <laughs> melon kiwi it kind of smells like honeydew melon <sighs> that smells really good actually let's see what they got for the trial sizes because i knew about that one the turquoise waters have y'all seen these uh news candles Twelve dollars. <clears throat> I don't like it. No. But you know what I'm here for? And this weekend, guys, come through. I like the little, you know. I like the outside though. I like the ombre look. I'm here for this. Yes. Ooh, coconut vanilla. What that smell like? Oh, I almost pulled this one. Oh, bitch. It's all right. I put their little decoration back. I hate to touch glass stuff in stores. I just feel like it's gonna be like crash. I'm such a clumsy motherfucker. Oh, man, I get so stressed out. And these are the new little hand sanitizers. There's the pocket back holders for them. This is what they look like though. You guys like these ones? I don't know. I like the old ones. They got a purple one. It's called Firework Fizz. Yeah, I'm just looking. Thank okay. you. These are new ones because they changed the packaging. Yeah. So now they put easier into your pockets because that's why they changed it. And I it guess. Comes with um, aloe and vitamin E. It's mm -hmm. a little softer than the other ones. But yeah. <laughs> so if you have any questions, All right. Jessica. Thank you so much. No yeah. Let me see what kind of hand. Like little mini ones they got. So I can get my little free one or whatever. So, so basically I have like a little free gift or whatever. So I'm trying to get something other than beautiful day because I have a beautiful day. Love and sunshine smells kind of good. Cause you know I love in this weekend. So I don't want to spray because the sprays don't last that long. So I'm just gonna make a decision and I'll let you guys know what I picked. Hey guys, I just wanted to come and show you guys what I got out of Bath Body Works. Because you know I'm indecisive as fuck. But um I got the love and sunshine. It smells actually really good. If they had the um kiwi and melon, I think it's called in the travel size, I would have got that because um I really like the smell of um cucumber melon. But you know, they don't ever want to do nothing right. But I'm actually at Target right now. I have to go inside and take my prescription so 
I'm hella tired. I was up till like four o'clock in the morning. Um, and so the shenanigans, I got back up at like seven something because Paris kept climbing on my face and stepping on me and putting her nails in my stomach. And I was like, do you, the sad part is she was up with me though. So, but she was like napping here and there. She was getting her little Z's in. So I'm probably going to go home after I get this and take a nap. This smells really good. Like, I didn't realize how... Like, when this first came out, I didn't really like it. But you know how, like, you'll smell something later. And you're like, hmm, that doesn't smell too bad. Like, it smells really good. I'm sitting in this car. It kind of smells like beautiful day. I'm going to stop hitting my lips on shit, man. Okay, I'm going to get out this fucking car. Because I'm going to sit in here and go to sleep. All right, I just want to hey show you guys. So, I just wanted to come by really quick and share something with you guys. Paris is officially off the charts like every vlog i've been telling you guys for like the past three vlogs she's driving me crazy she's not hunting for anything she's just driving me fucking crazy so it's hot out here that's why i like have a little fan in the window blah blah, blah. so it's been hot out here you guys know we don't have a regular summer in cali or oakland the bay area um it's kind of like we'll get it at the end of summer like end of july sometimes end of august early september so, um, it's been hot off and on in July. So, she's been being bad, right? She's been, when I say bad, she's been, like, getting on top of the table, getting the paper towels, tearing them down to, like, the core of them, and shredding them across the house. I have to come home, sweep it up. She's been doing this with paper towels, um, tissue, just being an asshole pretty much so my mom, i was like i'm leaving her in the kennel because last time i left her in the kennel shit was where it's supposed to be when we got back home <sighs> so my mom was like oh no don't leave her in the kennel she might want some water i know my child okay so i was like she'll be fine okay she'll be fine so i was like um no because she don't drink water like that. When she wants some, she'll go over to it, drink it, and then go lay down for eight and a half fucking hours. She's not thinking about that bowl. So she's like, no, 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 don't, don't, don't do that. Leave her in your room with the door closed. So I left the fan on like I do when it's hot. You know, I don't want her to die, you know. So I left the window open and I put the fan in the window, like I said. I come back. I'm like, okay, nothing looks like it's torn, like broken. But then, by my door, when I walk in, you guys know, I use the cotton rounds to take off my makeup, right? This is what she did to them. She ripped them to, like, shreds, pretty much, the paper, the outside. The inside pretty much looks like I could probably still use them. But the outside is torn. You can see bites in them. It was on the floor by the door. And I remind you, I keep it over there where I keep my makeup. Um, It was just like this and it's this is, looks like a new pack okay i don't bite on this shit i have no reason to do that so it was just like on the floor torn and my mom thinks this shit is funny like i don't find it funny because this is what i put on my face i don't want her mouth on there and her like poop paws like i don't want her shit on there and she ripped the hole in the bottom and started biting on the actual cotton rounds at the bottom She's pissing me off. So then I brought a calendar for one of my friends. And I don't know if you can see it, but she started biting a hole in that calendar. And on the back as well. And also, let me show you guys. Where else did I see? Claw my, oh, she put her fucking claws in there. Yep, there you go. She put her fucking claws in there. So for no reason at all, she's just been terrorizing paper and cotton rounds. So I'm like, well, what the fuck was that for? You have you have water, because it's not time for her to eat again. You had air. You had a bed sleep in. You had my bed. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's no reason. Then she went behind where um, I keep my little trash can in front of it so she can't climb behind the TV. Because we haven't found like a little cage or something to keep the cable stuff um, in. Because she climbs behind there and steps on it. And turns the cable off. Like the power, um, what do you call it? The, ca the cable strip. Like the um, c 
can't think of the name of that damn thing. <sighs> Shit, I forgot the name of it. But it's like the, um, all where all the cores going to, the power strip and shit like that. So she then went back there and turned that off. I had to come back home and turn that shit back on because she was back there being a hot ass mess again. She She's really working on my nerves, you guys. Like, I, next time I'm just leaving the kennel. I'm not going to be listening to my mom. I'm sorry. I love you, mom. But no, I know her. I know what she's going to be up to. I know she's going to be around here doing, tearing some shit up. And I'm surprised she didn't tear up my mail. Thank God she didn't because I would have really beat her. Like, I need all that mail. Like, I have a little stack of mail that is to remind me to look at stuff because I have stuff I got to pay off, bills and my car and all that shit. So um and like reminders of like baby showers and shit like that so <sighs> she is really trying my patience like oh i can't stand her right now like she's under the bed because as soon as i walked in the room she's laying on the floor i was like hey and then as soon as i saw that round she ran under the bed i was like you better run under that bed because i just started popping off i can't with her no more like i just how do you train a cat? Like, you could train dogs, but you can't train cats? Like, what kind of shit is that? So, we're at Tommy T's. I'm here with my mom and my brother. So, we're waiting for the show to start. We're here to see Mark Curry. I don't know if you guys remember him. He was on the Hanging with Mr. Cooper. Now, what other show was Mark Curry on? With Hanging with Mr. Cooper and... Right. He still lives in Oakland. So, <clears throat> yeah, he's pretty much been in Oakland. He's like an Oakland native, stuff like that. So, I'm excited to see the show. We just ordered some food. We're having some water because I'm designated driver tonight. And. So, if you haven't been to Tommy T's and you're in the Bay Area, you should definitely come. Um, on your birthday, you get like a free ticket for two to come out and enjoy the show. It's really nice. So, it's like what it looks like. It's like, I don't know if you can really see. It has an upstairs and a downstairs. So, that's the stage right there. So, I don't think they, um, I don't know if they allow recording while you are sitting here so I don't want to do too much but you know but yeah we're just gonna wait for the show to start and enjoy the show and for me stop you said for me stop there you go Woo! who brought you here my girl brought me here uh, what, you, what you want for your birthday at 29 I'm getting it later on are you getting it later on <laughs> I'm gonna give you some after the show, okay? <laughs> you love me. You, you get old, it ain't like that. We'll see. We'll get it when we get it. <laughs> Dang, you ready? You ready? There you go. All right, there you go. All right, be passionate. All right. And <laughs> do this while she sleep. Take a little money out of her purse. Oh. And then you're strong, you understand? Know, right? When you talking, you know me talking about. Let's make love. Say, what's your bank code? What's your bank code? <laughs> You're gonna take another 300. It's 10 minutes <laughs> with the town. We ain't sleeping. no good. All that love shit. Take a little money. Take a wig car, anything you can get. You hear me? <laughs> if a person Louis Vuitton, take that. Gotta stay young. Excuse my little appearance, whatever, but I'm in my pajamas and don't judge me. But I just want to stop by and I wanted to give you guys an update. So I told you guys and um, I want to say about a vlog or two ago, started taking these medications for my migraines. And I told you guys I'll give you guys an update. So for those who are not following me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, stuff like that, um, do not know that I gave you guys an update. 
so basically i'm just going to give you guys an update if you are following me you're going to get another update so this is just like a little bit more of an in-depth update um so the names of the products are true chest chest state magnesium i'm gonna show it to you okay so it looks like this is $12.99 at the food mill. If you don't have a food mill in your area, just look it up, the name of it, and then it should tell you where you can find it. This um, one's called Chastity Tree. I think I'm saying it wrong, but I'm trying to let the sunlight not hit it. And this one is called Cramp Bark. So this one's a liquid. This is a new bottle, as you can see. I ran out of the liquids a little bit faster than new bottles. Um, so those three together, I take those once a day. Take one pill and um, the Cramp Bark. I take a squeeze of that. I fill it up with squeeze, put it in a bottle, like a little bottle like this with some juice. And I shake it up, and then the uh, chastity tree, I take 15, it says 15 to 30 drops. I always take about um, 30 drops of that with some juice, because what water is gross. I'm not going to lie to you guys, it tastes disgusting, um, but it does the job. Honestly, it took about three weeks to kick in, but when it did kick in, I have not had a really bad headache. Um, in about, um, in about two weeks, and I have been praying for something, you know, like literally praying for something to come along and, um, help me with my round greens. Forgive me, I'm a little tired. I don't know why I've been sleeping well, but, but it has been for my grains. I mean, not sleeping well, that's something else, but, um, you yeah this has been a blessing so if you have really bad migraines or headaches i would suggest you definitely take a look into it um it's all natural so it shouldn't be a problem with the allergies i think it even says on the it says like it's made with like rice powder and um, vegetable cellulose and glycerin and water no artificial preservative um salt soy oh that's what i'm saying it says no preservative no coloring no flavors no salt no soy no sugar no wheat or no yeast so that's for the pills so it's just like for the you know the the liquid i'm pretty sure it's not a whole lot of anything in here either so um, it's gluten free so that's pretty much uh, what I've been taking I've been you know like I said I've been trying to eat better I've been doing my shakes in the morning and you know having better options for like lunch and dinner so um, I definitely have been feeling better you guys I'm so happy <laughs> I wondered for a long time I kept asking you know but I asked my mom randomly like I wonder what it's like to feel normal um, again so this is definitely a blessing in disguise so if you guys have any headaches or if you have any questions please leave them down below so um and i hope this can help someone in any kind of way and also on another um, topic sorry you guys i'm like like really kind of tired almost i don't know why <sighs> So, on another topic, I wanted to ask you guys something. What do you guys kind of want to see me do? Like, I know that you guys were, like, asking me for tutorials and stuff like that, like, and um, things of that nature. But is there something, like, you guys want to see me do more of, like, you know, like, vlogging or, you know, random videos, or, like, sit-down videos? Like, you know, what do you guys want to see me do? Tutorials? Like, um, you know, what do you guys want to see me do more of? Because right now, as you guys know... I will be saving money to um, move starting next month, so I won't be doing uh, many um, hauls, many um, favorites videos. That's gonna kind of come to 
a halt because I'm gonna be saving money and I'm gonna be um, relocating in about 10 months to a year so it's not like I can just be splurging and out here spending a whole bunch of money so I do want you guys to take that into consideration You can go again. Okay. But yeah, so anyway though, just let me know what you guys think and then I hope you guys can get some help from these medicines. So I will talk to you guys later.